Morning, you guys. So I um, was victim to. I don't know how to describe it other than let me show you the evidence. So I kind of opened a door with leaving a slice of pizza in one of these pizza boxes. And this is what it summoned. Something that I don't even know why it did this. I'm assuming a raccoon tore into this thing that I have these little like crystal gems in that I'm going to put in the garage. Why did he tear this open? I'm going to assume he just wanted to roll this around. Um, Freaking raccoons. And then, look what he or she did to all of my wizard roses. Seriously went and dug holes near every single one. Tore this one up completely. Just threw it. Straight up threw it. What was it after? Um, worms? Um, I don't know. Why? Why this massacre? Why have I been victim to this massacre? Like, why? Why did he do this to me? And look! Look at all my, uh, my lavender I've just planted. He just threw it right out of the dirt. Same with this one. Threw it. Just straight through it. And all of my, what are my cucumbers and my watermelons? He slaughtered them. They've been slaughtered. I'm sure I can replant them and they'll survive. Most of them. But what the actual... Why? Why do these animals need to be bastards? What did I ever do to them? I gave them a slice of pizza. And then he had to go tear up all my plants. So, that's country living. Don't leave any food out, because then they're going to come ransack all of your plants, because they're assholes. Like, why did he do this? What was he looking for? What? were they looking for? What? Worms? Why did you do this? You ate a slice of pizza and you destroyed my plants. Okay, well, you can just go away. I woke up this morning and I was just like, did a person do this to my garden? And then I saw, like, this... The pizza box is obviously scattered, and he also dug in my dirt. I'm calling it a he. Maybe that just shows that, you know, I always blame all of my destruction in my life on the men. But, you know, am I wrong, though? <laughs> so, this is my Monday morning. Um, I'm just going to say I'm thankful you got to always think of those highlights. You always got to think about the things you're thankful for. Um, that it's not super sunny out so I can still save these plants. They haven't gotten dried out and shriveled. So I can, I can recover from this. And I'm definitely going to have to go to a hardware store and get some fencing because this is... <sighs> well, now I need to get ready for battle. Because I know there's crazy bastards out there in the middle of the night trying to destroy my gardening. So, yeah. I learned something today. I learned something today. Hey, ma'am, ma'am. You ready for a walk, baby? You ready? You ready for the day? It's Monday. Good morning. Good morning, I know it's walkie time. Walkie time, honey. Maverick actually warned me in the middle of the night. He was barking like crazy. I would say probably around 2 or 3 a.m. I didn't look at the clock. I didn't even want to know. And he was just barking. So obviously I'm sleeping on the couch. He's right there in his bed and just wakes me up and is barking. No doubt it's because he's hearing the rummaging about with the pizza and 
the massacre of my plants and I was scared okay I was scared I told him to be quiet Maverick's pretty good he was quiet after barking a little bit and I was thinking that some person was out there in my in my property and I'm just like well I'm just gonna have to pray and try and could go back to bed and not think that someone's gonna come knocking on my door because I really don't want somebody coming knocking at my door at night because, you know, typically the last time that happened it was a certain somebody that was not good and only ends up hurting me more and more. So I would prefer that they don't come back. Anyways, um, thank you for listening to my Monday rant. I hope you guys were entertained by the fact that I have witnessed and been victim to a massacre. Happy Monday. <laughs>